What's up guys, back with another kind of super video and in today's video we're going to talk about should you summon on the 2021 swimsuit part 2 banner. Now these units um, came out last year. This is Aqua, Wiz, and the 3 star Megami. I think this banner came out the other day and I just missed it somehow. But it is up for 5 days, 22 hours. It is pretty much a normal banner but... The featured characters are the old swimsuit units. Now, this is the better of the two banners of the returning characters because Wiz and Aqua are both better than Ren, Melissa, and Darkness by a large margin, by the way. If you don't know what they do, we'll go over them real quick. So, the Aqua, I like her a lot, actually. She has a lightning, I tried to click on it, a lightning and light, uh, 6% attack bonus and her EX skill, 126 normal physical attack, sorry if I sound weird by the way, my sneezed a bunch right before I went to record, so, you know, dealing with that, but anyway, a 105 lightning physical attack to all enemies and a minor recovery, then a 172, uh, single target lightning physical and a moderate boost super gauge, this is the aqua I like to bring to stuff like dungeons and whatnot, a uh, very uh, nice unit, and the Wiz is the best Wiz sub. She has a 223 Lightning uh, single target, a 162 single target uh, Lightning Magic, a uh, moderate reduction to their magic defense, and a small heal for her basic, and then 6% magic attacks. This is why it's the best Wiz sub. Now, there's also a Megami, and she does bind and moderate boost to your magic attack, as well as having a 5% for dark and fire attacks. Now here's the thing, so, the Wiz is really good for Wiz sub, of course, but Wiz is kinda on the default, unfortunately. Uh, Christmas Wiz is still really good, but she is seeing less and less use, she's gonna go down as more, you know, stronger units with like Red Shred, or uh, they do what she does, but they hit harder, all that kind of stuff, so... Keep that in mind if you do summon. The Aqua is still really nice, but Legendary Aquas pretty much can make her not be seen at all. But this Aqua is still a nice character. I personally wouldn't summon on it unless you're really tr like a big uh, Aqua or Wiz fan. Um, I think I'm a huge Wiz fan, and I'm actually not summoning on this just so I can summon on Chris. And maybe see if I get Wiz. Maybe after Anniversary. Um, uh, this banner's not going to be out, unfortunately, but... I might throw a couple multis at Chris if I end up not getting her, but I'm not going to go crazy and chase this Wiz because I think the next best Wiz that I remember off the top of my head that's like truly like, oh gosh, really good, is a backline Wiz, I think, the New Year's one, because JP has um, this like trait thing. I'm not too sure how it works. I'm going to have to look into it because I've done a total, like a huge look into the JP content because we haven't been getting anything uh, crazy from it recently besides the uh, secondary ults but that's been so long ago. But pretty much I believe it gives you a trait skill of earth damage so people run in the back to get that but it's still not anything you know that you would need this Wiz for so it's really up to you if you like Wiz you use her a lot you know. There's this, but I personally would not recommend summoning. It's still like normal, a normal banner, so the odds of you just not getting Wiz are still there. Um, it's not guaranteed four star, all that. I personally think that summoning for Erica and Chris is still way better. You can still pull Wiz on those banners. You cannot pull the new 2022, such as Aru, Iris, Celio, Erica, Chris, uh, Mitsurugi, who's going to be the three star on Chris's banner. Can't pull them on this banner, so. Much better to spend your quartz on Chris and Erica, but of course, if you are free to play or don't have a ton of currency, definitely, definitely save for anniversary. And that'll pretty much be it for the video. Let me know down below if you are summoning, what you got, are you thinking about summoning, are you still safe and strong for Chris or for anniversary? And don't forget to like, subscribe for more Konosuba content, and I will catch y'all in the next video.